All right, my friends, today we're going to review the Donut of Shame, specifically designed for dogs. All right, so what we're looking at here is the inflatable dog collar. And what this does is replace the cone of shame that dogs will sometimes have to wear if they've been injured or have surgery or a spot maybe on their head or something that they don't need to rub or we don't want them to scratch and pull stitches out or something else like that. I didn't want the big cone because... Uh, my poor English Bulldog would just ram into everything and catch it and he'd be miserable. Uh, so I went to PetSmart and I found one of these bad boys. It's basically just kind of an inner tubey thing. It's got uh, some softish canvas covering on it. It's got a Velcro opening to put it around their neck. It's also got three loops here and here and here to thread their collar through and you can put their collar obviously back on them and this that will hold, help them hold it back on and you just use the velcro to adjust uh, it came in this box obviously it was deflated before it came in this box and there was nothing else in the box just this in the box and it's very simple um, it's got this air valve and you just blow it up. The nice thing about it is it is much more comfortable than the hard plastic cone. Um, they don't have a big edge, you know, that hooks on a corner, running into everything, trying to get through a sliding door, but all of a sudden their head's this big instead of this big. Uh, this doesn't stick out as far, but it's wide enough to block their paws or back feet from getting toward the, into their head and, and scratching that thing. It's also good at preventing their head from getting to uh, their hindquarters because this will also block that kind of motion where they're trying to lick their hindquarters if there's an injury back there or whatnot. So protects their head, protects their hindquarters. So and it's super comfy and it's. You know, that cone is like almost torture, the way I look at it when I see a dog with it. This, they put it on, it's not that bad, they get used to it in a while, and it's actually kind of, you know, maybe even comfortable. I don't want to say that, but it is nice, soft and air. It's just like an air-filled pedal, so. Uh, this cost me 39 bucks. Um, I looked on Amazon uh, just now. I could have got it a little bit cheaper, five bucks, but we picked up our dog from surgery and kind of forgot about preventing him from scratching his ears, so I had to run to the shop and, and get this. They gave us a plastic cone at the vet, but I'm like, no way. I've seen, you know, better, more comfortable options, and I ran to the pet store and bought this. So I paid a few bucks extra because I bought it locally, but hey, I'm supporting a local business, you know. Do I recommend this? Yeah, absolutely. I would recommend anybody get one of these. They come in all kinds of different sizes. They make them for cats. It's just so much more comfortable for your dog your, or your cat rather than having a hard plastic shell kind of locked around their neck. Instead, they've got a nice air filled, basically a little inner tube. And obviously you can get these with different coverings. They have fleece. If you want a fleece covering, you can get that. This canvas is pretty soft and does the job just fine. And I don't think it's gonna be very durable and last. And your dog will have a happy, happy, recovery so let's see a few clips of uh, raider my english bulldog with this on and see how horrible it is catch you later
Okay, so after using this for a while um, on my Bulldog Raider, would I recommend it? Absolutely, no brainer. Um, it's worth the extra cost over the cheap plastic cone. It's just so much more comfortable for your dog. It's just an air filled inner tube with a nice soft covering on it that blocks them from scratching their head or reaching around and, and licking their hindquarters. Highly recommend it. Pay the extra few bucks. Your pet will love you for it. And so will I. Hey, don't forget to like and subscribe if you liked this video.